humongous jump from, like, having a belief with nearly no evidence to support it, right? Like, a great deal of conspiracy theories in regards to COVID. Like, people think, like, for example, like, they're having a chip being put in them with the vaccine, right? Like, and then they, they make all these other assumptions, like, yeah. blah, 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 blah. And, I'm, yeah, yeah, go ahead. I'm just gonna, I'm just going to preface this off of that conspiracy theory. <laughs> Number one, from a cybersecurity perspective, a government contractor working perspective, they don't need to tip you. You have a supercomputer <laughs> in your pocket yeah, that you yeah. carry around you yeah, 24 hours yeah. a day that you that they can hear you with. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. it's if they don't need to chip you. They know where you're going because of this in your pocket. Yeah. 100%. Like, yeah, but, if they were to do it. Yeah. I mean, like, don't get me wrong. I would love to get into that, uh, but, you know, we'll, we'll save that for another time. Yeah. All right. Uh, just to keep it more on point, it's, it's like, like you said, willing to be wrong, man. And yeah. it's not, it's not like, <laughs> it's not like you're throwing out a comment just to be wrong, right? You're going to, you're going to give your most valid opinion yeah. on something, right? Your most logical. And be, if, yeah. Be like, be 100%. Yeah. With, be, yeah. Be 100%. Like, be, you got to be real with be, your, yeah, exactly. with your beliefs because, yeah. It's good to be wrong because it checks your perspective. Yeah. And that's so important because yeah. it's such a good learning experience. Mm -hmm. You know, you're, if you're always, if you think you're right all the time. And you're odd, attached to being right. Too. Yeah, exactly. It's like, you're, you're going to be, you know, oh, yeah, okay. like I'll, I'll head with the, the fucking best quote. I love this quote because it is, it is the man who claims to be the wise man that is truly the fool because the fool admits that he does not know everything. So the fool is truly the wise man, yeah. because he is willing to accept what is what he does not know, and he understands that he knows nothing. For the wise man that is always right, believes he is infallible. He knows everything, but he truly knows nothing. Yeah. Definitely, man. Yeah. yeah. And one last thing I'll say before we close out this segment is that when we, you know, like you said, when someone acts as like they're all knowing right like yeah. consciously all knowing through their mind and conceptually they oh my god you gotta be fucking kidding me i look oh go 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 okay okay i remembered it it's like and like when they when they are proven to be wrong right like yeah. and like no matter how much evidence they have to back it up it's purely objective they'll fall back on their subjective excuse reasoning right and they'll oh, continue yeah. to make excuses in order to stay in the comfort of their own beliefs and boundaries right in order to maintain that illusion illusion of all of omnipotence yeah. and satisfactory of being right yeah fucking splendid <laughs>